Okay, so the next thing we're going to look at is what to do when you have a change in variable costs. So a change in variable cost evolves the total cost equation. Remember, this changes the slope. So an increase will cause it to have a greater slope, and a decrease will cause it to have a smaller slope. The higher the variable costs, the higher the level of the break-even point. Because remember, the total cost does not affect the total revenue graph. So let's look at this example. The variable cost of a certain unit is 30 dirhams. Same problem as before. The selling price of the unit is 60 dirhams. The capacity for the period is 200, and the fixed costs are 3,000. So the exact same setup as before. Find the break-even point if the unit variable and costs increase by 10 dirhams. So this would affect the total cost equation. So that would mean, let's start off with where we're at. The total cost right now is 30 times my quantity minus, or sorry, plus 3,000 dirhams. The total revenue is 60 times my quantity. So now if the unit variable cost increased by 10 dirhams, then the total cost would be 40 Q plus 3,000. So the break-even point would be when this equation equals my total revenue. So we'll go ahead and start with that. 60 Q equals 40Q plus 3,000. We start by solving for Q. So we move 40 over and we get that 20Q, excuse me, I didn't use my colors, equals 3,000. So to solve for Q, we divide both sides by 20. We'll get out our calculator for that. 3,000 divided by 20 equals 150. So that would mean that my quantity is 150 units. Now this isn't the break-even point yet, so we need to put it back into the total revenue equation. So my total revenue is 60. And now we're going to put in the 150. So we put it into the calculator, 60 times 150, and we get that my total revenue is 9,000. So in order to find the break-even point, the break-even point would be 150 comma 9,000, looking at my units and my dirhams. So if we look at the graph, our original cost would be here at 106,000. But when the variable costs increased by 10 dirhams, it went up to 159,000. So this is just a 10, 10 dirham increase caused us to have to sell 50 more in units in order to turn a profit.